Hey guys, what's going on? This is Ziggs, and in today's video, you're going to be watching me coaching Eric, and in this video, we get into a lot of mid to late game macro, which is what a lot of you have been asking for, so please leave a like on the video, because I've answered the calls made of the game leapers in the comment section. But just a quick spoiler alert, the first like two to three minutes, they include me coaching Eric a little bit in the early game. I think there's a really important period of time in his game that I think is going to be really useful to every single one of you in terms of like playing around Rift Herald and trying to like sequence into important objectives as efficiently as possible, and that's also tied into hitting level six as powerful as possible as well but yeah any questions about the moves let me know down below i'll also timestamp the video so if you really do want to get into the mid to late game stuff you can of course skip it so yeah leave a like down below guys for more videos like this if you have any recommendations or any like requests around video topics again leave them in the comment section if you want challenger coaching for any role any champion it doesn't matter you can dm me on discord or check out the website down below this session is on patreon along with hundreds of others that i've done recently so check those out too don't be shit by yeah man like er eric you are allergic bro to press recall <laughs> yeah you need to go see a doctor bro you've got a diagnosis or something <laughs> mm, now we back off now we grow pools or something Good pings. Eric, this is excellent, man. Like, I'm super impressed. Mid lane dies. If that is a cannon wave, Eric, you always go mid to pick it up here, but it won't be. The next wave will be. Yeah, I think that's one of my weak points yeah. where I don't pick up and up, uh, pick up and up waves. Okay. Um, I would go to crab here, by the way, I think. Okay. I mean, going red buff is fine. I'm thinking level 6 spike here straight away. Yeah, but like, you're not gonna... It's not really a spike because everyone's dead, see? So what I would do yeah. if I was you, I don't think she's ever going to take your red buff, Eric, after she shows, right? Because she, you know where she is. So if she goes into your red buff, you know it's a possibility now, yeah? Just the fact she's shown bot side. It's very difficult for her just to, like, run off a wave into your jungle. I think anyway. Yeah, that's true. So I think you should look at her and look at her HP. If she's full HP and full mana still, of course she might do it, yeah? But the other option there, even if she does that, is you just go to her red buff after crab, yeah? So yeah, if I was yeah, you yeah. here, I'd go to Crab, and then I would probably recall. Uh, reason being is, like, why? There's a couple of things. Boots or Blasting Wand. Good. So your level 6 uh, spike is, is... one minute. Yeah, yeah. And uh, Infernal is also up. Right. So there's a few things here, yeah? So first of all, when you do red buff, you've got to wait 15 seconds for Krugs. Then you've got to wait a little bit longer for Raptors, yeah? Like, you finish Krugs, come up for Raptors, you've probably got to wait another 5-10 seconds, yeah? Yeah. I would rather you go crab here into a base. Depends what Diana does. If she's still staying around here, Eric, and you know she's like taking this, you can take her red buff, I guess. But still, you're running 10 seconds to take a red buff, and then you're basing, right? Because you know you took her raptors. And you also know that she went to Krugs, right? At a base. That's what you pinged, which was excellent. So there's nothing up top side but her red buff. Yeah. And what you can do instead after crab, instead of going like this 10 seconds. Then doing it, you can just recall, and you're running out here, yeah? Into a Rift Herald. You're actually at Rift Herald quicker by clearing your own camps there, you see that? And if yeah, you if you I go to Crab, if you go to Crab, which is in 10 seconds, yeah? And you recall, Krugs, Red, Raptors are all up in that sequence. Now you should come yeah, down here and just check Red Buff. Well. Yeah, you just check Red Buff, just give it a little look. If it's there, do Krugs. And we can come up, right? The move you have to make here is actually just like probably waiting for Top Crab, yeah? Because, yeah. like, I just look at your bot side, bro, and I just see 4 seconds and then 34. If that said 24, Eric, and then, like, 44 for Raptors, or 14 for Krugs, yeah, I yeah, actually yeah. kind of like it, because what that means is, you, even if you take red buff there and you don't do anything with it straight away, is that you take away the bot side of the map, where, first of all, you're losing, but also you want to play for Rift Herald soon. So you get rid of the bad side. So you just clear it, so there's no counterplay when you recall and run to Rift. Yeah. But because the timers are really awkward here, your actual clear into Rift Herald has to be top crab, base, drugs, red, raptors. Then you can do anything, yeah? Do anything you want yeah. at that point. So just because your red buff is up, Eric, don't think you have to go here. That, you know, applies as well. If you run out of base and come here, you check it, it's up, I'm going to Krugs. So I want to go in one motion rather than here, here, here. Uh, oh, you went for an invade here. Yeah, I had no camps. I didn't, I didn't know what to do here. And I saw that red is coming up. So I was thinking of you like, don't have yeah, all, right? I might just snag this. Yeah, exactly. It's and down. Diana's going to run there as well, bro. She has the same time as you, Eric, probably. So why not just base here and get a large rod? Oh, 
That is fucking true, man. Right before Rift spawns as well. Yeah, I wouldn't even... Uh, yeah, I mean, you could go to Rift Hell for sure. But I would even think about going bot, yeah? Um, second Rift doesn't really mean that much. I would rather be playing, like, near the lane. Maybe this is, like... We can talk about this maybe in, like, another sesh. But I'd rather um just go to a lane where I can kill. I think it's harder to kill Fiora than it is Zed, right? If you, in a, if you play with Aurelia, it's easier, yeah? So here, because Aurelia's gonna go bot, and also, like, just in this game, Eric, you see, like, these towers. So top tower is gone, right? T1 top. Or T3. So tier 3 top is gone. Tier 3 mid and bot is still up, yeah? This is the easiest objective, man, to get, right? Because it's, like, isolated, and it's harder for them to send resources here, yeah? Mid is difficult to, you know, kill people on, because there's often vision around here, you know? Often vision. Yeah. But bot is a little bit easier for you to get into, even through lane is fine with an Aurelia. So as soon as, like, if I was you here, and I get that fat kill, first of all, like, whenever I get gold, man, I'm just thinking of, of what it actually, like, gives me. Like, what is that number represent? Well, here, you're 70 away from a large drop. That's my first thought. So after I do walls, my Gromp isn't quite up. I can't invade her red buff because I don't have ultimate, and she knows it's up as well. She'll probably run there. No way. Let me just recall into a large drop. I'm pinging Zed in the bot tower. That's what I see. What the Say like if I uh, if I don't have an Aurelia and I have a like a Vega uh, running bot now instead, would that I'd go change there anyway. the outcome of where I would go? I don't it would think go so. there anyway. Yeah, I'd go there anyway, man. Because Diana's gonna run top. Like you're probably gonna two v one the Zed, and even if you don't, you can um like your Krugs will be respawning some kind of soon. So let's just say you ran into Tribrush bot, and you know you knew the Zed was like recalling or hood recall. You could always just go back to Krugs, and you can always always like set up in their jungle for Dragon. Like check their blue, check their Gromp or whatever. Look at Diana here for buffs. Yeah. I'd rather be playing around this Dragon Man than Second Rift. I think Second Rift is pointless unless you know 100% you can't contest Dragon. Okay. So around these objectives, you're trying to play like the outskirts, yeah? Not through the middle. Like, there's pretty much like two... Because like, remember, there's only two entrances, right? To River Eric. Yeah? Yeah. So, if I split the map like this... This channel is fucking AIDS. Don't run through here. Yeah, that's usually where, like, everyone in below Diamond gets stuck as well. So everyone in Master like, Bro gets stuck in GM a as well. That's where they play. This is fucking ARAM. Always yeah. fucking ARAM. Yeah, so you need to play outskirts. Yeah? Last going over. Hit that way at all. Just attack side lanes, man. Like, it's very difficult for you to go mid onto AD carries when there's supports next to them with control wars and everything. Yeah, you know, yeah, like yeah, in this yeah. brush, in this brush. I've been there, MF Thresh or some shit like this. It's fucking impossible to get near and get the pick. Yep, so these three, these four entrances, one, two, three, four, where they, like, kind of connect, if you will, do not fucking go near this area, all right? This guy is so much easier, yeah? Yeah. So much easier, bro. Don't have to make it difficult. Oh, get her, get her, get her. Rocket Belt? Yeah, she's dead. Nice. Leave the wave and base. I mean, actually, no. Like, you staying here is fine, because why? Why, 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 why? So what did we just get? Um, We killed the top laner. Uh, so we get plus 300. Back. Don't, just look at you, Eric. Don't look at anything else. Just look at you. Plus 300, right? What does that gold value represent? Large rod and what? Are you going Shadow uh, Flame? Need, Are you going Death Cap? A death cap all the way. So I need 200 gold. Good. So you go to Rift. Yeah? And you make sure Ezreal doesn't base, yeah. yeah? You go to Rift, make sure Ezreal doesn't base. You can leave the wave. Like, you can do two things at once, right? Like, as a team. Do Rift Herald. Sign's always got the top wave, yeah? Be efficient. I don't like this either, man. I think you can, um... You can do anything here, bro. Clear your top side and base. Two large rolls are still fine. Because it's very difficult to get death cap, right? Like, how much is death cap now? Is it 35, 36? Uh, it's uh, 1,000 more gold. It's 3.6. It's 3.6 total? It's two yeah. Two okay. large rods and 1,100. Right, so it's like impossible to get it here, yeah? But you still need yeah. another 600 gold, right? So you can clear your top side. So why would I say clearing top side is good here, Eric, after doing Rift Hold? Like, why am I happy uh, with this? More what gold, are we playing more for? XP. Yeah, okay, that's, that's true. But, like, what are we playing for? Uh, I want to get Death Gap Ace up. Yeah, but like in terms of like where we're going to go, like where do we really want to play on this map right now? Like remember, eight minutes is what? What do we want to think about even around seven minutes? What do we want to think about pathing into? Uh, around seven buffs. minutes. Okay, so buffs and then into what? If we're mentioning this, I probably forgot it. 
All right, seven minutes, and then time keeps ticking, right? And then all of a sudden, it's eight minutes. What's on the map? What spawns at eight Rift. minutes? Right, Rift, right? Something is on the map here, bro, that we want to play towards, yeah? Which is what do you uh, think? Bot turret. Bot tower, right? Like we talked about. Very good, yeah? So can you see, Eric, how you could just get rid of the bad side of the map where you don't want to play? It's not close enough to Baron, yeah? It's not 19 and a half minutes, right? So if it was, like, near Baron, you could always... You could still clear this top side and go Krugs, Rapses into Baron, yeah? But here there's no Baron. So you can just go blue, Gromp walls, into a base. You come out to Raptors. You come out to Krugs. Anywhere the fuck you want. If you think there's a play, just run bot and kill them. If you don't, you can go Krugs, Raptors, and then I'd probably suggest coming down like this again. Yeah? Again, yeah. this is AIDS. That channel. Does that make sense, man? So here, just clear your top side. Get rid of the side of the map you don't want to play near. Recall. Run to the side of the map that matters a bit more. Yeah? So I know there's no Dragon up, and Baron's up sooner than than drake but that bot tower man is the most accessible thing here for you yeah, and, yeah, and therefore yeah. attainable yeah 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 100 percent makes sense because it's important yeah it's more gold there is probably with the rift i can maybe get two turrets if i get a kill as well or they gotta send a lot of people down to stop that shit and they're a ramming mid right this is middle of the map yeah of course they are it's fucking diamond this is middle of the map, yeah? Look at that line. That is the most terrible line of all time. Right. <laughs> <laughs> That's a tier three. That's a tier three. That's tier three, yeah? So if I draw a line through the tier threes, the wonky line, you see, like, Eric, how when we get to tier twos, we're getting closer to their nexus. Yeah. It's easier to get this because it's further away from this. And therefore, closer to yours. That is a long way away. That is a fucking long way away. Therefore, it's harder to get, yeah? Yeah. That's free as fuck. Okay? Just important, when you run out of base again, try to get in these areas first if you think there's a kill. If not, just go Krugs, Raptors, and you can run in. You can probably run in here, right? I doubt anything is watered here. Yeah? So that's when you can run through that channel, all right? Yeah. Because when you show, bro, it's like uh, like Diana ganking bot. She's probably not going to invade your red buff because you'll probably expect it, yeah? So when they see you, they're going to yeah. expect stuff. So you need to stay hidden.